These notes are on a concept called the domain, and this is an, a topic that you have sort of been introduced to in section 2.1. Um, just a brief definition, the domain is the input values, also known as x values, in a function. And now we're going to do a few examples to explore what it means to, to what it means if you're asked to find the domain. So in example one, we're given this list of points and we're asked to find the domain. So we say domain. And there are a lot of different ways to write domain. For now, we're going to just have it be just simply um, a list or a phrase. So in this case, the domain are all of my x values. So that's 1, 5, and negative 9. So 1, 5, and negative 9. Example 2. We, this, in this case, we have an equation. y equals... 3x. Um, in this case, basically I'm asking what can I plug in for x? Um, and I can plug in any number I want for x. I can put in 1, I can put in negative 1, 0, a half, um, even numbers that you've seen maybe in formulas uh, for some geometry things like pi. So we say that the domain is all real numbers. And mathematicians have a very fancy symbol for this. They do this R where it has two lines in the front. Our last example, we're going to look at a table. On our table, we have x's and y's. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, five and then dot 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 all the way out to an n and we say we've got 10 5 0 negative 5 negative 10 and then we say that this is negative 5n plus 5. So in this case, it's a lot of numbers. I'm not going to keep listing, because if I list all the way out to n, I would spend my entire life listing numbers. But I do need to find some way to say that I have the numbers going from 1, 2, 3, 4, continuing. So there's a couple of different ways to do that. One way is to say that the domain is 1, 2, 3, 4, dot, dot, dot. And that tells me that it continues forever. Another way to say this same thing is that we have our counting numbers. These are the, I always remember this because these are the numbers that you first learn to count with when you're a little kid. One, two, three, four, five, etc. 